Hi there. So for this question then, we had to find the coordinates of Q where L1 crossed the curve C. And you can see that those coordinates then for Q are X is 1 sixth and Y is 17 over 12. So just to take you through the method, like any question where you want to find the intersection of two curves, all you need to do is use simultaneous equations. So we've got the equation of C and we've got the equation of L1 and we use the method of substitution here. So what I've done is I've substituted equation 1 then into equation 2. Wherever I've got the y, I replace it with 3x squared minus 4x plus 2. So that gives us this equation here. Simply expand the brackets, rearrange it so that you can group it up as a quadratic equation that equals 0. Then this equation factorizes to 6x minus 1 times x minus 1. And then you can put each of the factors equal to 0 leading us to x equals 1 sixth or x equals 1. You could get these answers if you even use the quadratic formula. It's up to you. Well, we know x can't be 1 because that's the x-coordinate at p. So therefore, at q, the x-coordinate must be 1 sixth. And so all we need to do is substitute x equals 1 sixth either into equation 1 or 2. 1 is the easiest because it just gives us y straight away, in my opinion. So sub it into there and you end up with 17 twelfths, okay, for the y coordinate of q.